Hey guys, it's me again. Today I will show you how to improve the jump of a 2D character. For this tutorial, I highly recommend you to watch the previous tutorial about movement, as we are going to use that project to improve the character jump. I'll leave the link in the description below, so don't forget to check that out. And before we start, if you're enjoying these tutorials, please leave a like, that will help me a lot to bring more videos. So let's begin. First of all, let's create a game object that will work as a feed for our player. Right click on our center, add a new one, I will rename it to feet, and now we are going to add the components we need, the ridge body 2D, change the body type from dynamic to kinematic, and freeze the rotation on Z axis here. We need also a box collider, don't forget to check its trigger, I'll first position here below our player, and resize the collider now. When you are resizing the collider, make sure it's not too wide, and too far from the player, as you may have some issues with it. Try to do like I'm showing on the video now. Ok, now let's create a script that will define the behavior of the feet. I will create a new script, call it feet, and that's about it. But before we edit that, let me show you what we need to change inside our play script. In here, the change I made was, I delete the onCollision method, we don't need it, here, and the ball is jumping now is public instead of private. Now let's go to the script attached to our feet. Here inside our script, first we don't need the update method, so let's delete it. And now we need player controller variable. This is a script attached to our player. I'll call it to our center. I'll call it player. And on the start method, we need to get a component. So player equals get component in parent and here player controller now we need to create a void public void on trigger enter 2d I like to change the name of collision to other this is just something I like and in here if other dot game object dot compare tag the tag we need ground and player dot is jumping equals true inside here player dot is jumping equals false save the script here on unity make sure your ground has the proper tag the value of the jump force is okay i set mine to 800 and now let's test now you can see my center is jumping all over the place and is not jumping on the wall anymore we fixed that problem, so only if the collider triggers with the ground, we are able to jump now. But if you see, we are still getting stuck on the walls. It's very easy, I'll give you a tip how to solve that problem. To do that, it's very simple. Right click inside the project window and select create physics material 2D. In here, change the friction to zero. Select the center and inside the box collider, there is a place for us to add the material. Just do it and the problem is solved. And if we test now, you can see that our center is no longer getting stuck into the walls anymore. Okay, so if you've done that, congratulations. Now you have a jump improved. Okay guys, that's it for this video. If you have any question, suggestion, or anything you just want to say, please leave in the comments below. And if you enjoyed it, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more tutorials like this one. So stay awesome and see you in the next one.